You know what? I mean, I, I just think we we didn't execute down the stretch on both ends. You know, we hit, we turned the ball over a couple of times. We had the lead. Um, you know, we had the lead to six or seven and had the game. At, you know, at our pace. And then you know we just took a couple bad shots and, and really didn't get a couple stops we needed. And then we, you know, quite frankly, we turned the ball over at critical times. And, and you know, statistically, we just got to make some shots. We got to make some plays. We're putting so much pressure on our defense uh, that right now, you know, we're um, you know we're not as bad as we think we are, but we're not quite as good as we need to be. Mike had a, had a big game, but I. Think it seemed like you just didn't have enough help out there and you really never could get that going. Yeah, Phil, I mean, you know, uh, you know, right now, I mean, you know, I, I'm not, you know, Nat is just struggling, just can't make a shot right now, you know what I mean, and that happens, you know, uh, but that's that's a that's a physical thing as well, or that's a mental thing more than a physical thing, it's just one of those things where, you know, right now, you know, three games in three days, and, um, you know, a little bit of dead leg, and then uh, they had great energy, a lot of credit goes to BU, you know, they did some really good things today, and we just, you know, we never got going today, we were off, we were off balance all day today. How much do you think the injuries played a factor going into the second half? Well, we certainly got to a limited bench. You know, I mean, uh, Dave was, you know, in and out with a bloody lip, and Stevie's out. Uh, you know, uh, we have a short bench as it is, and, and some other guys just weren't playing real well. So, uh, you know, it, it's, uh, it is what it is. I mean, that's what happens sometimes when you play three games in three days, and uh, we just didn't execute down the stretch. You know, roller coaster the last couple of days where it was a big win yesterday over Cleveland State, and then a couple off today. So I imagine you're going to be really curious how the team responds when you get back to practice and go forward. Yeah, I am. You know, um, you know, as I told them in the locker room, uh, you know, the good thing is we got a little time to go home and practice. We've had two weeks here where we've really been on the road and haven't had a lot of practice time. Um, today, uh, you know, we get home tomorrow, we'll, we'll take a day off, and then we've really got four days to get ready for our first league game. So uh, we'll get back after it on, on, uh, on Monday, and, uh, you know, uh, hopefully we can start to right the ship. Three games this weekend, four games in six days. Do you think the team caught up to you guys? Yeah, I think it did a little bit. You know, I'm, I'm not going to make excuses. Again, a lot of credit goes to BU. Uh, they had a little better energy today. And really, you know, in all honesty, they were the best team in the tournament. They should have beat Cleveland State the other night. You know, they beat Rhode Island last night, and they, and they really had an opportunity. Uh, you know, and obviously they beat us tonight. So, you know, a lot of credit goes to Cleveland, uh, to uh, BU. And, you know, we have to do a better job if we want to win tough games like that. Steve, he's one of those injuries because he's had a little bit of a tough start here, and now he gets hurt. And it seems like he's being challenged in particular right now. Yeah, you know, and, and certainly, you know, you're looking for him to play a lot of minutes, and obviously he couldn't do that tonight. So uh, that, that hurts us. Do you have any update on the injuries? Uh, not really. I, you know, I think Stevie is, um, you know, he's going to be out for a while. I guess. I, you know, it's a hamstring thing. So those are uh, those are tough injuries. We don't really know. You know, I think we'll be able to reassess it tomorrow. Um, the other guys are just, you know, going to be day to day a little bit. Dumb. We'll be all right. Uh, I guess one quick question um, before we wrap things up here: How do you bounce back from a tough weekend? like this. And do you, is this the type of weekend where you'll try to focus on more of the positives than some of the negatives? Uh, you know, that's that's always a big challenge as a, as a team and as a coach. You know, you have to find ways to bounce back. You know, one thing uh, I've always been proud of since we've been here is that, you know, whenever we've, we've fallen down or not played well, we found a way to get them back, you know, mentally and physically. And uh, that's something we're going to have to really do, to do you know, uh, this week. We have to get them back. We can get back to practicing and hopefully we can get back to playing well.